Today, my friend Wudo is trying to beat the game. But I have a mod that lets me turn into a dog. Oh my gosh, look at me. Let's see how many times we can mess with him before he figures it out. Let's open this door. Wait, why did my door just open? Uh, and uh, Oh, hello there, Mr. Doggy. What's your name? I don't have a name, Wudo. Stop looking at me like that, okay? Well, thankfully, I have some bones. So let me try and tame you, little guy. Oh, guys, okay. The first step is already working. He's going to try to tame me right now. But, wait, why is this not working? Why aren't you getting tamed? Oh, no, I think he's catching on. We have to, like, do something to act like we're tamed to him. Okay, we'll just shift a couple of times. Come on, bro. We're already tamed. Stop trying, okay? We're tamed. We're tamed. Oh, well, whatever. I, I'm, I'm sure he's tamed by now. It's probably some glitch. And uh, let me just quickly name you real quick. Oh, he has a name for us already? This little guy is kind of smart. I think I'm going to name you Dingle Dude. What? That name sucks. What's up, Dingle Dude? Why would he give me such a bad name? Dingle Dude, what? You're going to join me on my journey to beat the game. Okay, since Wudo gave me such a bad name, we have to make sure we get him good. Dingle Dude, I need to go start mining and get some resources. So why don't you come and follow me? Yeah, okay, I guess I'll join him. And uh, since he's going to go mining, I have the perfect prank to pull on him. Oh, Dingle Dude, look at this. It's a huge cave. Oh, yes, it is, Wudo. Oh, and this cave looks like it's kind of bad. But what is that hole right there? Wait, what is this hole? <gasps> Whoa, is that a ravine? Guys, I'm going to scare Wudo real quick. I'm going to hit him and then jump straight down. What, what was that? Dingle Dude, there's no way that was you. Nope, that wasn't me, Wudo. Is there like a zombie up there? Anyways, I think Wudo's going to start mining some ore soon. Yep, there's some iron ore right there. So what I'm going to do is go into my inventory and search up iron ore mine. What's going to happen is whenever Wudo mines this, he's literally just going to explode. So I'm going to put some right here for Wudo to mine. He's definitely going to be surprised by these. All right, Wudo, there's some iron ore for you right there, buddy. Oh, there's so many good ores here. This is perfect. All right, that's enough coal. And oh, look, there's more iron over here. Oh, it looks like you discovered it. Come on. <laughs> Wudo literally just blew up. What in the world was that? Iron is not supposed to blow up. And what happened to all my stuff? Yeah, iron definitely isn't supposed to blow up, Wudo. But I'm going to be nice and give him a pickaxe. Let's get a stone pickaxe from him real quick and act like it was just right here. Oh, there's my pickaxe. Oh, okay, Dingle Dude, this cave is way too dangerous. Let's just go back home. Okay, it looks like Wudo's already giving up on mining. I mean, I would too if my iron ore blew up. And to be nice to Wudo, what I'm going to do is place a bunch of iron ore right behind him so uh, he can actually get some armor and some tools. Let me just hit him so he pays attention. Ow, Dingle Dude, stop biting me. <gasps> Wait a second, you're trying to show me this iron. Perfect. Oh, it looks like it doesn't even blow up either. This is exactly what I was looking for. Kind of weird how it was placed so randomly, but I guess that's just Minecraft. Okay, Widow's catching on already, but I think we'll be fine. He's not the smartest tool in the shed, but I'm really interested in what Widow's gonna do after he mines all this iron. All right, now that I've gotten plenty of iron. I'm just gonna go back to my house and smelt these ores. Come on, Dingle Dude, let's go. All right, looks like Wudo's going back to his house, which is kind of good because I don't want to stay in that cave anymore. Ah, home sweet home. I'm just gonna go ahead and start smelting my ores, and while I do that, I'm gonna go and start working on my house. Well, I do need to get some resources to do that, so Dingle Dude, you sit right here. W wait a second, why are you not sitting down? I'm right clicking you. Uh oh. Okay, we need to press shift so we can look like we're sitting down. Okay, he's sitting down now. Don't move, Dingle Dude. I'll be right back. Looks like Wudo left me in his house, which is kind of good because I feel bad for killing him inside the cave. So this time, what we're gonna do is decorate his house and make it look nice. We'll start off by getting some iron blocks and replacing his wood floor with some iron. And I'm sure he's gonna be super happy about this because every iron ore gives you nine iron ingots and that's super good if you're looking for some loot. After that, we're gonna replace his red bed and since Wudo is a turtle, we're gonna give him a green bed instead. So let's just search this item up and let's replace the bed and since Wudo is a turtle what we're gonna do is add some turtle eggs at the corner of his house and then we're gonna add some lime green banners and put down these lime green candles what we're also gonna do is get an armor stand and some diamond armor and we'll be placing the diamond armor on the armor stand so Wudo can finally get some good loot to defeat the ender dragon and now his house looks 10 times better he has some turtle eggs he has some green stuff and he also has diamond armor so I'm sure he'll be super happy with this all we have to do is just wait for him to come back oh all right home sweet home and wait a second what happened to my house oh it looks like wudo's super surprised guys what in the world who added all of these disgusting 
changes. What? Why did Wudo call it disgusting? What the heck, man? This took forever to build and it looks super nice. Oh, my feet are so cold now. I hate iron blocks. And what are these ugly green candles doing here? And why are there only two? Bro, what is Wudo saying? I thought he likes the color green. Turtle eggs? Why are there turtle eggs in my house? They should be outside and on the beach. And this green banner isn't even the right shade of green. Okay, Wudo's just being mean at this point. We're gonna have to get some revenge because I'm not gonna take all that after I'm trying to be nice to him. I'm taking all of this down. I definitely don't want any of this in my house. Oh my gosh, this guy can't be serious right now. Look at him. He's literally breaking everything. Hey, wait a second. Is this diamond armor? There's no way that this is real. This must be fake. What? How can diamond armor be fake? I think he lost his brain when he went to get wood or something, dude. Like, what is he even saying at this point? Okay, I basically broke everything. Now I'm gonna fix my house. What does he mean by fixing it, man? I thought it was so perfect. But there what we go. Some nice granite floors. Now my feet are in nice and warm again. Now with that disgusting cold iron. I don't even want that. What? How does this block look better than iron? Okay, Wudo's definitely delusional. I'm gonna make sure I get some good payback. What I'm gonna do is wait for it to turn nighttime and make sure Wudo gets super scared. Okay, guys, looks like Wudo's still organizing some items. And as you can see, it's about to turn nighttime right now. Oh, look at that, Dingle Dude. The beautiful sunset on another Minecraft day. It is pretty beautiful, Wudo, but you're not gonna be having fun in a second when I decide to troll you with a bunch of mobs. So while Wudo is staring at the sunset, what I'm gonna do is go outside and get some mob eggs in my hand. I'm gonna get some cave spiders, some creepers, some skeletons, and finally some zombies. All right, Dingle Dude, I'm heading to bed. I'll see you tomorrow. All right, then, Wudo, you can head to bed, buddy. Come sleep inside like a good doggy. There we go. And make sure to keep that door shut. We don't want any evil mobs trying to get into our house. Yep, I agree with you, Wudo. I agree with you. All right. Good night, Dingle Dude. Okay, and while Wudo's sleeping, what I'm gonna do is spawn in a bunch of mobs outside his house. Wudo should be hearing these mobs soon. Wh what is going on? I just got attacked. What is this? Why are there so many mobs? Oh, what? Dingle Dude, where are you? Oh my gosh, I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. What? Is this a nightmare? Is this a nightmare? Oh my gosh! My help! Whoa. Dingle Dude, where are you? Ow! Okay, Wudo's house got completely destroyed. On top of that, what I'm gonna do is burn all his items. After he called my build ugly, I'm gonna make sure I get some payback. And there you go, all his items are burned. Okay, it looks like it's already morning time and Wudo is coming back to see his house. Oh no, my whole house is gone and there's lava everywhere. Oh man, I worked so hard on that house. Okay, now I'm starting to feel bad for destroying everything. Wudo's super sad. My house is all gone. My stuff is all gone. What even happened? But at least I have you, Dingle Dude. Aw, uh, okay. Wudo's being super nice to me and this whole time I've been super mean to him. If I lost you, Dingle Dude, I don't know what I would have done. You mean the world to me, Dingle Dude. Okay, I feel really bad after Wudo said all that, so I'm gonna help him complete the game because I literally destroyed his whole entire house. You know what? I have to stop being sad because that's not gonna solve anything. I'm just gonna get more resources and then I'm gonna go kill that ender dragon. I need to find a way to get stuff really quickly. Oh, I know what I'll do. I'm gonna go find a village. Okay, so Wudo's actually pretty smart. He's gonna go look for a village. And if you guys didn't know, villagers actually have some really good loot for people to start out with. And what I'm gonna do is make sure I put a surprise inside the village for Wudo. Oh, look, I see a village already. I'm gonna go over there as fast as I can. Okay, it looks like Wudo is actually pretty lucky. What we have to do is find a house with a chest in it because we're gonna be putting some good stuff in for Wudo. Whoa, this village looks pretty cool. I need to find some villagers ASAP. Oh, there's a villager. Mr. Villager, come here. Please tell me you have a good trade. Oh, what? These trades suck. Just emeralds for bread? Oh, come on. This is the blacksmith. He has to have something good. What? Just leather armor? This sucks. Okay, I actually feel really bad for Wudo, guys. He's trying to get some good trades, but all these guys are not giving him anything good. So what I'm going to do is surprise him by going inside this house. And as you guys can see, there's a chest right here. So what I'm going to put inside this chest is some really 
good stuff. First of all, I'm gonna replace his diamond armor, and then what I'm gonna do is give him a diamond sword, a diamond pickaxe, and a diamond axe. And while we're at it, let's also give him some golden apples. And since Wudo needs to go to the nether, we're gonna give him some obsidian and a flint and steel. Now let's just open the chest and put all this loot inside for him. And then now we just have to find where Wudo is. Oh, there he is. What I'm gonna do is punch him. Oh, hey, Dingle Dude. And now he should follow me. What, what are you taking me to? What is it? You want me to open this chest? That's right, Wudo. Open it up. What? Is this diamond armor? What? I didn't know villagers had this much good stuff. Thank you, Dingle Dude. I would have never checked that chest. That's right, Wudo. Now you should have some pretty good stuff to beat the Ender Dragon. I feel bad for everything I did, so this should make up for everything. I'm not leaving this village just yet. Now that I'm so powerful, I'm going to use it to take my anger out on the villagers. <laughs> what is Wudo doing? Die, villagers, die. I gave him diamond armor. Now all he's doing is killing villagers. These guys give me bad traits. All of you are going to die. What is wrong with Wudo? He's a psychopath. Okay, this should be the last one. And there we go. No more villagers. That's what you get for giving me bad traits. Oh my gosh. Is this the true nature of Wudo? This guy is super scary. I do not want to mess with him. Come on, Dingle Dude. Let's go to the nether. Oh, I guess I have to listen to everything he says. This guy is super scary. Let me just kill this villager on my way. Oh my gosh. What is wrong with this guy? Now let's just go to the nether. There we go. All right, Dingle Dude. I want you to be extra, extra careful, okay? I really don't want you to die. Okay, and now we're both gonna enter the nether. And whoa, this nether looks super scary. Ooh, this is a pretty interesting spawn. <gasps> Wait a second. There's a fortress right under me. All right, guys, I just got an idea. Since Wudo was super mean to the villagers, what I'm gonna do is break every single blaze spawner in here. So let me just make my way inside. So we'll just start off with this one. There you go. And there should be a couple more. So let's go break those. Let's go into game mode spectator to find the rest of the spawners. Okay, it looks like there's another one right here. So what we're gonna do is go back into game mode creative and break it. And there you go. And looks like those were the only spawners inside this fortress. Now Wudo doesn't have a way to get blaze rods. Where the heck are the blaze spawners? I've been looking everywhere. Did you see any Dingle Dude? Uh, no, I definitely didn't see any Wudo. Oh, uh, I forgot Dingle Dude can't even talk. Uh, whatever, I'm just gonna keep on looking. Okay, it seems like Wudo is really ambitious to find these spawners, but little does he know there aren't any. Come on, there's gotta be one somewhere. Oh, I've literally looked around everywhere and there's not a single blaze spawner. How am I supposed to beat the game without blazes? Well, it looks like I really can't beat the game today. Maybe next time. If I can't find any blazes, I'm just gonna delete this world. Oh no, that's not good, Wudo. Don't delete the world. Okay, I don't want him to delete the world. I wanna keep trolling him. So what I'm gonna do is get a chest and put some blaze rods inside of it so Wudo doesn't quit the world. I'm just gonna go around the corner, put this chest right here, and put some blaze rods inside of it, and there you go. That should be more than enough. And also, what I'm gonna do is put some ender pearls, so he doesn't even have to go trade with piglins. All right, Dingle Dude, I'm just gonna delete this world, so, uh, this is my final goodbye partner. No, 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 there's a chest right there. I want you to open it. Wait a second, there's a chest! What? Blaze rods and ender pearls? Oh my gosh! I didn't even know that there would be this kind of loot inside a fortress. It looks like I don't have to delete the world today, Dingle Dude. We can really beat the Ender Dragon. Let's go. Wudo gained his confidence again. That means he won't be deleting the world. We're safe. We can keep trolling him. And boom. Just like that, 16 Eyes of Ender. Let's go kill that Ender Dragon, Dingle Dude. <laughs> let's do it, Wudo. All right, Dingle Dude. Now that we've made it out the nether, let's use these Eyes of Ender and go find the stronghold. The Eyes of Ender are pointing this way. Let's go. Okay, it looks like Wudo's wasting no time to go defeat this Ender Dragon. Oh, it's been such a good journey with you, Dingle Dude. We've been through so much together. My house was ready randomly griefed with that ugly stuff. I got attacked by zombies and creepers in my sleep and it destroyed my entire house. And now we're gonna go kill the ender dragon? I've really been through it all with you, Dingle Dude, and I'll never forget that. Oh, uh, Wudo's actually a really good guy, except to villagers. He does not like villagers. Man, we got here in no time. Wudo's actually a really fast Minecraft player. All right, come on. Wait a second. Did the eye just go down onto the ground? That means the stronghold is here, Dingle Dude. Okay, looks like Wudo found it. Let's start mining down Wudo and I'll follow you right behind. Oh my gosh, we've been mining forever. Where is the stronghold? <gasps> Wait a second. Look at this, Dingle Dude. I think I found the stronghold. Whoa, look. 
Look, it's the library. Jump down here. Okay, I guess I'll just jump down and follow Udo. All right, Dingle Dude, let's go and find that portal. It has to be somewhere here. Quick, Dingle Dude, follow me. All right, looks like Udo's trying to find the end portal. This place is huge, so make sure you stick behind me. Come on, it's got to be here somewhere. All these twists and turns are making me sick. Oh, just more dead ends. Come on, Dingle Dude, can't you help me out? Oh, that's a good idea. Let's help out Udo by searching for it. Okay, we'll just go into game mode spectator. And where is this portal? It's hiding from us. What? Dingle Dude? Dingle Dude, why aren't you following me? Where'd you go? Oh, no. Don't say I lost him. Okay, we have to hurry this process up because Widow's getting suspicious. All right, so it's right above Wudo, but how do I get him here? Hmm, let's see where we can take. <gasps> oh, I know. We can just take him right here. Go up this way and take it left. Okay, I know just what to do. All right, let me just punch Wudo. Oh, there you are, Dingle Dude. Oh, my gosh. You scared me. Don't run off like that. Okay, don't worry about me, Wudo. Okay, I'll just go this way. That's right, Wudo. Keep going that way. I know exactly where to take you. All right, let me just take these stairs. All right, now that Wudo's up here, what I'm going to do is make him follow me. What? Dingle, dude, why are you running so fast? And it's right here. <gasps> Whoa, no way! Dingle, dude, did you just lead me to the portal? Okay, you're literally like the best dog ever. That's right, Wudo. There's no dog better than me. Anyways, look like Wudo's putting in all the pearls. That means we're going to be fighting the Ender Dragon soon. Oh, and there it is, Dingle, dude. The legendary end. Are you ready to go and kill that dragon? Yes, sir. Let's do it. I'm just going to punch Wudo in. Dingle, dude! And then I'm going to follow Wudo into the end. All right, Dingle, dude. Stay close behind me. That ender dragon is really, really strong. And since I want to help Wudo beat the game, what I'm going to do is use a secret weapon to help him out. What we have here is a power 255 level bow. This thing is super powerful, and it will help us beat the ender dragon. So what I'm going to do is just fly all the way up here. Whoa! There's the ender dragon. Okay, what we're going to do is help Wudo out by breaking the crystals first. Wait, what is the explosion sound? Oh, Dingle, dude, is that you up there? How are you shooting a bow? Wudo can literally see us breaking the crystal. This is too funny. I'm just going to break the rest of them. I don't care if our cover gets blown now. We're already in the end. Dingle, dude, how in the world are you flying? Okay, there you go. That's the last one right there. And boom, all we have to do is kill the ender dragon. Dingle, dude, you broke all the crystals. Thank you so much. I can't I can't believe Wudo is literally falling for this. First of all, dogs don't fly in Minecraft and they definitely can't shoot a bow, but it's whatever. What we're gonna do is shoot the ender dragon and come on. There you go. We got one shot in. How are you doing so much damage to the dragon? What kind of bow do you have? And how are you even shooting it? Okay, yep. It looks like Wudo is super surprised because with one shot, we literally got the ender dragon to half health. Come on, dragon. Get down here so I can kill you. Okay, I'm gonna be super nice to Wudo and give him this bow and some arrows. So he'll be able to get the last shot in. What is it, Dingle Dude? What is it? Quick, the dragon's perching. <gasps> Whoa, is that a bow? Quick, quick, quick. Let me grab it. I'm gonna shoot the dragon. I have to wait for this thing to fly again and shoot it, Dingle Dude. It's so close to dying. This bow is so OP. How did you get it to level 255? Uh, let's just say I'm the most magical dog in the world. Come on, dragon. Just fly away so I can kill you. Oh, there it is, Dingle Dude. Come on, let me shoot you. And we killed it. Let's go. We killed it, Dingle Dude. Congratulations to Wudo. He just beat the game once again. I can't believe I killed the dragon all on my own. That was way too easy. Thanks for just sitting there, Dingle Dude. That was pretty helpful. What? Yo, what is this guy saying? He's being sarcastic and trying to say that I did nothing when I literally broke all the crystals, did half damage to the ender dragon, and gave him a bow. Okay, I definitely have to come out and tell him that I've been pranking him this time. So what I'm gonna do is turn back to my normal self and tell Wudo I've been pranking him this entire time. Hey, Wudo. What? Mongo? What in the world are you doing here? Well, let's just say I've been your pet dog this entire time. Wh what? You've been Dingle, dude? There's no way. Yep. Why would I be lying about that? Here, let me show you. I'll just turn into a wolf right now. What? You're Dingle, dude? That's right, Wudo. I've been Dingle, dude, this entire time. I saw everything. You hurting the villagers. Matter of fact, I even got you killed in your own house and in the caves. What? Why did you do that, Mongo? I really thought you were a real dog. Well, well, I just wanted to prank you, Wudo, but I did see many sides of you that I did not want to see, okay? You literally killed the villagers for no reason. What is wrong with you? What? No, I didn't. What are you talking about? You didn't see anything. I literally saw it with my own eyes, Wudo. Whatever, Mongo. If you think that you're better than me at the game, I'm going to go and kill the Ender Dragon myself. Um, looks like Wudo just left. It looks like the pranks were super good. And if you guys want to be good at something, hit that subscribe button and watch the video on screen if you want to see more.